Anime is its name, Japanese animation is its game, and its cult following is making its way into the mainstream. Animania has descended on Sydney. I'm at the City Town Hall at the convention, and I'm literally surrounded by Animaniacs. In its third year, Animania opened its doors to thousands of eager fans, many of whom dressed up as their favourite anime character. So what is it that makes people so passionate about anime? I think part of the appeal of anime is that it's kind of exotic, so it brings some things that we don't get in Western popular culture. It brings um, cosmic destruction and cosmic drama, intensity brings uh, eroticism at a level that shocks some people. Like but the boy on boy stuff? Yeah, boy on boy stuff, the, boy, the boys who are girls who are boys, um, sex and death, I mean stuff that adolescents have always loved and young adults and it's always going to have that edge on it. Just ask Suzanne, one of many fans for whom boys love holds much appeal. Boys Love is a cult following by a lot of anime fangirls who enjoy the thought of two boys kissing each other. On offer at the convention are modelling competitions, a gaming area, panels, drawing contests and a chance for up-and-coming artists to exhibit and sell their work. Being here, well I've been in attendance at uh, almost every anime here, uh, but this is the first um, year that I've had a table here uh, promoting and selling what I do. The animation industry in Australia is starting to boom at the moment, so I think there's a lot of opportunity for new animation companies to come out. And we're all young, and so I don't know, we'll see, see, see how we can go with this company. And in case the excitement proved too much for some, First Aid was standing by. While anime is very much popular culture in Japan, in the West, love of anime has been considered something only geeks would admit to. Until now, conventions like this demonstrate the breadth of anime's appeal. Even you may have the stirrings of an animaniac inside you, if you loved Astro Boy, Transformers, or the story of Oren Ishii in Kill Bill, all these grew out of the phenomenon of anime. Don't worry, animaniacs look like everyone else. Hello, fear the tentacle beast! I will find you and penetrate. <laughs> well, almost. Schoolgirls must fear my tentacles of fury. Well, well, whatever. We're done. All right.